So Megan Beasley here, you are the champion of the women's 400 metre hurdles. Bit of windy condition there, how did your race go? I think it wasn't my perfect race, but no one really will get that in these windy conditions. So I just wanted to try and execute something I can be happy with, run another 55, which I did. Um, and just win the race, because that's all I needed to do here. I've got the time, and I'm just so happy to finally get a gold medal. <laughs> As you say, like normally you come into the race, we've got Ailey Doyle, um, but you've come in with a favourite. Does that put extra pressure on you, or do you feel relaxed? Oh, so much more fresh air. And they even make everyone aware of it by giving you the red bib. So everyone knows you're the favourite. I think I'm, it's one thing going into a race as the underdog and just having to execute a good race from fast. But it's another thing thinking, like, I should win this. So I'm glad that I fulfilled my expectation of myself. And um, I can't, yeah, I'm just happy that I'm through to the World Cup now. So that was great. Um, and you mentioned the World Cup, but also you've qualified to represent Great Britain automatically in the European Championships, along with your training partner who ran a PB and came second, Kirsty McCaslin. How amazing is that going to be, having two of you in that race? I know, I was so happy. We can be roommates and we can train together for it. It'll be great. Um, I was having an interview with the BBC and all I was kind of half thinking is, I don't know what Kirsten ran. I know she came second. So I was just looking at the time and when she ran it, I was like, where is Kirsten? I have to go and find her to congratulate. So we, we had a bit of a celebration together. A few days off from training and I think now. Yeah, well, we'd already planned tonight to get chippy tea and some lo a load of cookie dough. So great evening for us too. <laughs> have a good night.